Welcome to Rudo Tech Challenge. Today we are going to talk about how to connect three power source with changeover switch. I mean three inputs of power supply with changeover switch. You know, changeover switch only give option for two inputs. I'm talking about terminal for maybe generator, terminal for utility, and terminal for the load. So, what of if we have another power supply that we want to connect to our load? How are we going to do it? And this question was asked from one of our subscribers. Watch this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Let's dive in into the video. So, what we're having here is utility. We are doing a single phase now. I will do three phase later if there is any need for it. And single phase generator and this is single phase solar system we are making use of two single phase changeover switch and this is our distribution board so what we are going to do first is we are going to connect the load first so that after that we are going to focus on the utility um, utility solar and generator connection of the power source so what we are going to do is we are going to connect the both changeover switch together we are going to loop them together which we are doing here right here we loop the life with the second life of the changeover switch together and we are doing the same thing for the other one to neutral so this is what is going to serve as our load so we are through with the load side connections so now let's now start from the utility we are going to connect live and neutral of the utility to the first input of the first changeover switch and then we are going to do connect the generator to the second input of the changeover switch We all know that the output of this changeover switch is the load which we have already done that and we are going to come to the second changeover switch and connect our solar system to it live and neutral so with this we are through to our connection very very simple very very straightforward but the most important thing that you need to be conscious of in this connection is this when you are using one changeover switch the other must be on neutral what i mean by neutral is is not connecting to any side it will place it on neutral so let's say you want to make use of this changeover switch this one must be in the middle it's not connecting to the solar because if you connect it to the solar is already powering this load and if you connect, if you switch this changeover switch to any of this utility or generator, that means you are connecting two power source together and it's going to be a disaster. Now we are going to see how the position of this changeover is going to look when we are switching to each of these power source. First, we are going to switch to the utility and let's see how it's going to look like you can see that the our load is being powered by utility and you can see that it's only utility side we switch to which definitely is utility side that is supplying this load and you can see the position of the generator free position of so, um, solar system free also let's switch to generator you can see that the same thing nepa is free solar system is free now let, let's now make use of the solar system you can see that this one automatically immediately we put it first in neutral before we go and switch over to solar system there is a vid there is a video i'm going to upload i'm working on it on how to make automatic changeover switch with three source like this so watch out for the video once i'm through with my research on it i will do the video and upload it please 
like share and subscribe